Should we detonate nuclear weapons for testing again? The world's nine nuclear nations have performed over 2,000 nuclear tests. But the Comprehensive Test Ban Treaty banned them because they were causing radioactive contamination and fueled nuclear proliferation. All nations stopped testing over 20 years ago, except for North Korea, which stopped in 2017. The U.S. military now considers computer simulations so accurate that nuclear test explosions are unnecessary. But the U.S. government has recently floated the idea of restarting nuclear testing. Is that a good idea? Let's hear what some nuclear weapons experts think. We and the Soviets and Great Britain signed the limited test ban treaty forbidding all tests of nuclear bombs in the atmosphere. As a result, there have been no such highly polluting atmospheric tests anywhere in the world ever since. It's, it's really imperative that the nations of the world get together and work toward eliminating the threat of nuclear war. The resumption of nuclear testing that is being considered by the uh, Trump administration does just the exact opposite and is very likely to reignite a nuclear arms race. Both international law and national law are wildly incompatible with these two features, the spectacular level to injure and the solo act of it being brought about by a single person. So we have the ability to dismantle this architecture, but in the meantime, at the very least, we have to abstain from actions such as renewing the, the practice of testing. A return to nuclear testing does not just impact Nevadans and those downwind residents who would rightly fear whether their groundwater was safe to drink, their air safe to breathe, and their cattle safe to graze. A nuclear war cannot be won and must never be fought. If we get hit by thousands of nuclear missiles, or even if they, we don't, but our nuclear missiles go off as planned, then uh, we would get Earth enveloped in a cloud of soot and dust that might lower the temperature over Nebraska by 40 Fahrenheit, and in fact make it snow in the summer in most of the agricultural regions on, regions on Earth, which could easily kill 90% of everybody on the planet. Even a war between India and Pakistan could produce global climate catastrophe. So we're still working on this, trying to warn the world about any use of nuclear weapons, and testing would just allow other countries to expand their arsenals and make the situation work. In this period of worldwide pandemic, scientists from all nations must actively cooperate to make the world safer. Resumption of nuclear weapons testing would do just the opposite, making the world a much more secretive and treacherous place while diverting funds away from the fight against a clear and present danger. We need to stop spreading nuclear weapons. We need to be sensible about this. Most scientists know that nuclear weapons, nuclear testing is a very bad thing. I'd like to just end by saying the Comprehensive Test Ban Treaty is an essential instrument in controlling and eliminating nuclear weapons. We should ratify it, not abandon it. To do otherwise would all too likely lead us to nuclear catastrophe, whether by design or by accident or through terrorist agencies.